So I thought, I just got done um, washing my face. I washed my face twice. I used the Milk Cleanser first and then the Deep Pore Cleanser by La Bride. Um, I thought I would just come and do a check-in about my face because um, I posted my new um, La Bride skincare routine that I was trying. And it's been, I guess, a week since I posted it. So it's not, I'm not going to have like dramatic differences that I you'll see like in a week but i can tell you while i'm doing this this is the deep pore refresher by labra i'm just putting some on a cotton pad a cotton bud i'm wiping it all over my face but i will tell you i have seen a difference in the um, plumpness of my skin already i can tell a difference that it's more plump and um I also can tell now anytime I get acne or spots it always leaves behind a scar okay so I mean I've got scars all over my face from um, old acne that I've had old you know um, skin problems and so what I thought was acne over here this time actually ended up being hives um, I have some autoimmune diseases and one of the side effects of one of them is hives. And so I broke out in these really hard bumps and I thought, and this is the, um, the brightening pad that I'm using now. Um, so I thought it was cystic acne. Well, I checked in with my doctor and it wasn't, it ended up being a rare case of hives that just appeared like cystic acne so that's what was happening over here and like now like this spot right here it's red but it's flat and before it was I mean it stuck out on my face like this I mean it was huge and I was really good I didn't pop them squeeze them do anything to them that I wanted to do I kept my hands off of my face which you know if you have a pimple that is hard to do you want to get in there and squeeze it and get it all out and all that well i behaved and i kept my hands off of it like she told me to and she was okay with me using these products um this is the brightening cream okay just get a little bit of that on fingertip put it all over your face because i want to brighten the whole face um but these products from La Bride, they are aloe vera based, not water based. The majority of your skincare products, you're paying for water. So these are aloe based and aloe is a healing component. If you didn't know that it's a natural herb healing component. Um, so that's why I've started using it because I need something to help my skin. I need something to help my skin heal because I have all of these places that I need to work on. So that's why I started using the Labra. And even though it's not only been like a week or so, like I can tell a major difference. Now this is the AHA Time Release Serum that I'm gonna put on now. Um, just one pump of that. I can already tell a huge difference in my skin just in the physical appearance of it, how it feels. It feels much more nourished than it has been feeling. So that is great. I love that. This is a smooth and firm eye cream. Um, just gonna put a little bit on my ring fingers. Tap those together. Tap that under my eye. Just like that. I mean, and already, like, I can tell, like, it hydrates under my eyes so well because I get really dry under my eyes. And so, um, that, this has really helped. And I do this twice a day. Um, now I'm going to mix my Argon Face Serum from 1818 Farms with my um, aloe vera jelly um, to use as my moisturizer. That's what I've been doing to moisturize my skin. And it really, truly does moisturize your skin. Um and just a dollop of the jelly and I just mix that together in my hands and rub it on all over so yeah so I just wanted to kind of give you a quick update it's, like I said been about a week I can tell a difference in the plumpness and the moisture of my skin 
and I can tell um, they have gone down. My um, hives have actually started begun healing. Um, so when these were like big and like poking out and stuff, I did really good, I didn't touch it. So it's gone down on its own. I've left it alone. I've just kept with the um, routine using all of these products. Um, like I had another, like that's one that's come up, um, a hive that's come up that it is just pretty bad down here. It's just pretty bad. So as long as I can keep my hands off of it and not scratch it because you, you don't want to scratch it and open them up obviously. But, um, but yeah, so the Labrie stuff is really starting to work. So I just thought I'd give you a weekly check-in and just kind of let you know what I'm seeing so far. It is hydrating. It's moisturizing under my eyes where they're really dry. It's taking care of the hives. It's helped them calm down and cool down. And um, so now I just, I'm just going to keep using it and I'll check in with you um, probably next week and see if we can see even more change in my skin. So I just wanted to give you a quick update on my skin and the labrai and how it was going. So I will talk to you soon. Bye.